only going to miss the God that realizes his worth and his emotions and everything else that he's giving her access to is no longer provided to her. And when she wants it, guess what you're going to be doing? Giving her a hard time to get it. And not in a forced way, but in a way of, okay, well, I'll give you a little bit, but it's never going to be a lot. So let's get into an example real quick. That can look like you're hanging out with her. She asks you about your day. You're telling her. Then she wants to ask you things about your personal, personal life. Oh, like, why have you been so upset about that? Like, tell me how hurt that made you feel. You do not need to go into details and tell her, like, man, it just made me feel less than a man. Or it made me feel like they didn't want me there. Or it made me feel like, oh, I can't get that position anymore. So if it's going to be job-related, however or whatever it is, doesn't matter. You have to put a stop because the female that sees that, oh, I want more of him. That's where the I miss you comes in naturally. When a guy is literally, like, here, on a plate, on a platter... Everything you need to know, every single feeling and emotion I'm feeling, it's here. When it's a woman that you want, it's completely different than if you're speaking to somebody that is your family member, your mother, um, somebody that does consultations like me, or if you are going to go see somebody, if it's going to be therapy or a psychiatrist. Like, it's completely different when you're dealing with those people compared to a woman that you want because feelings are involved that's going to have you get more offended when she doesn't give you what you want but but here's the but but you went ahead and gave her something that stopped her from missing you stopped her from being curious and wanting to know more about you so i'm saying the way a woman's wired up is not going to be set up the same way if a female is there to get to know you or to actually build a relationship with you she has to look at this man as like oh there's more to him or where he's headed to where he's gonna end up being whoever he's gonna become or this progress that he's making i'm so interested by that and that's where the i miss you comes in because she's missing parts of you as well so don't let that go over your head it's literally almost as literal as that let it sink in parts of you right? If you think about somebody missing something, they're missing maybe your presence. They're missing wanting to talk to you. They're missing how you're really feeling because all of you is not exposed to them. So when a woman has a man that just throws himself at her or is like, yes, I want to make sure that you know everything about me. I want you to know all these or I'm going to be so open and vulnerable with you so you know how serious I am or I can't help myself. When you go ahead and take that step with a woman that's not prepared to actually be there to emotionally support you and be committed to you, you're setting it up for disaster because unfortunately, respecting you is not going to be really happening and a huge lack is going to come in so i say that because like the idea of i miss you doesn't have to be overly complicated as i said when there's certain things that are already going to be missed about you and certain things that are going to grow a curiosity or a love or a like of wanting to be back around you for these specific reasons how you make her feel then that hits different and this is why i do so many of these videos because if you think about I miss you, you can think of so many different ways to view I miss you. Yes, perception is going to matter. However, there's just so many things out there that are different from each other. Like a prime example for an upcoming video one day can simply be that she misses the adventure that you guys had together. She misses the memories, right? Because also love languages are real a whole nother topic I got to talk about, but love language can involve future plans. Literally, like somebody can be in love and want and just so excited about what the future holds with you. I hope it's not love bombing, right? Because you don't want that. But if it's going to be a love language, that's a bond that you guys are creating with each other. So that's just one some, one of the love languages. But like, that's something in itself because if she has like physical touch as a love language then that could also just be 
you guys onto each other and just being around you, how you hold her, how you make her feel safe in your arms. And man, I could just keep going, but y'all know if you want more exclusive, there's Patreon, YouTube membership, and there's also consultations if you want to get deeper into your situation or whatever that is going on with you. So we can really, really cover what's the key and what's the way that you have to go about it and how to figure out your situation. And I give you guys game plans, strategic ways, and just simply ways that are real progress strategies. Not, okay, this is going to be how you can get a, get a game going on or win it over with her. It's just going to be, how is this going to mentally better you? And how does naturally nothing for us fall into place? And also just, you don't want to be fed up, tired, exhausted in this process, right? So I make that so much easier. And if you don't want to do the consultations, you can always just check out everything else that I have available. So sleep affirmations, bundle deals for all the books that I have out there, how to get her to miss you. I literally have that. That's what I got to start talking more about. But I do have that. And also, don't forget about the masterclass and everything else. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and get to the wrapping up for this part of the video and saying that Remember that it's about what you've done that she has to look more forward to and want more of. So if she's going ahead and realizing you're the type of guy that is very much gonna be on his stuff, gonna be making things happen, and she's feeling like, okay, well, I don't wanna like ask for that time. And so time goes on and then she's realizing she wants more of it her emotions are going to get the best of her. And that's where the seeking, reaching out, coming back around you, all of that good stuff is going to come into play. And she's then going to go ahead and want to see you. And that's always going to work out for you. So I really hope this video was helpful. Make sure that when you're dealing with a woman, you understand that she's missing these things about you and you don't have to show up more to give more of these. Give a bit let it go a long way and then let her want more. Let her see that desire built up, that interest builds up. And then it's going to be, okay, she has to go into action. She has to be expressive of what she's been feeling or how she's been feeling you've been making her feel. That's a whole different topic because remember, a woman can just get caught up on their emotions. That's it for this video. Don't forget to stop, subscribe, like, comment. Bye, y'all. Or if there's other stuff that you have going on, it could be about anything, self-improvement, back to dating. Consultations are available for that. Book your consultation. Let's get on the line and talk about what's going on with you. Click that link after this video. Sleep affirmations so you could become that powerful man and it is recorded in my voice and I give you the strongest affirmations to overall become that man and subconsciously become powerful. So let's get into these books gonna track woman you want and get her to miss you along with secrets to winning her over and it tells you about cold approaching it tells you my personal stories and if you're trying to up your game in the dating game these books are going to be perfect for that and you could get it all in a bundle deal make sure you click the link down below are self improving in the process this is so serious this is why i have a whole no contact guide and journal available y'all could go ahead and purchase it if you need somewhere to start off then you need all the breakdowns all the insight the information and i have structure in there help you prompts things that will tell you you got this but it'll give you also reasons why and i have stories in there that tells you why no contact has worked for people all types of stuff it's so detailed y'all that's how much information i made sure to put in there step up no contact or if you need somewhere to start and you need something to help you this is like me guiding you as you go through no contact that's how i customized it for y'all so you can check that out by clicking the link down below see what you could do with no contact how far you could do it just learn everything have the guidance and well, accountability partner although i'm not actually there you'll feel that sense from this journal and guide